whether it exposed the weakness, he's always going to have to fight to over. That we showed you here on HBO, that between Larry Holmes and Mike. Due to a puncher. Keep that jab in his face. And that he just was a little bit lazy, especially in the later rounds. So I had the same experience when I fought my first 10 round in Baltimore. Easy or lying. What is your journey? It's that anticipation fighter. They say heavy-handed like George Foreman, but much no, faster than George Foreman. He's complaining about the, uh, the head of Mike Tyson. Nice. In fact, he credits Customato with his career period. That was about a three-punch combination by Mitch Green. And uh, you have to make a guy like Mike Tyson respect you. Good uppercut there by Tyson. Come on, let go, say. Another thing that uh, Mitch Green is doing, he's trying to tie up. That's where you got to come back punch like that. How you feel? Great. All right. Give me a little water. Leave him. You understand? Wu style. Holding the gloves up close to the face. Why? Tomato's former pupils. I'm sure Larry Merchant will talk a little more about it. And you'll see that that's what Tyson tries. But as far as how solid those punches are, there's no comparison. Now heard Mitch Green's no wrestling, no corner wrestling. tell him, tie him up in there. Watch the left hook of Mike Tyson land. Every time Mitch Green moves backwards. The other thing that strikes me, Ray, is that Mike Tyson just seems to be right on top. You know, it's time and time again, that left hook and those little short shots. You notice that there is no mouth pain, a lot of leverage, the body shots. Watch for the left hook. And he did draw a warning from Luis Rivera, the referee. A very impressive round. Getting all of his shoulders. Blue. That's something. Give me this. Blue. Get him on the outside. Hold it. And again, Mike Tyson bolting out of his corner. That's exactly what Green's corner. Green has been bleeding from inside. Tyson's fight. Try to fight him inside. Try to exchange him to the mouth. You know, the last. The, the problem he's making, he cannot. Um, Keep, and the mouthpiece is gone once again. Green breathing through his mouth. Thought less than six inches. He just shake Mitch up. Those big board shoulders, big arms, hands high. He works his way in. Rounds, so there's no need for him to slow down. The momentum. Got a long reach, but he doesn't use it. Active punches. Uh, he's staying right in Green's chest. He's just why it's so difficult for Green. To move because I want to mention one other thing too, and that is that it wasn't only the mouthpiece. That'll just get second time he has worn Green. Now Green scored with a right hand, and it did. Green cannot continue to take these type of shots. Don't score, don't score. Is that any sort of indicative of anything in particular? The mouthpiece. Not a smart thing to do because the mouthpiece protect. You notice that uh, Tyson elusiveness. He has said nothing about his punching. This is. This is how I got knocked down by Kevin Howard by moving around too much. You gotta slow down a little bit. When you get lateral movement, you don't need your excellent exactly one. Just move from side to side and stick the jab, but snap it. You gotta draw it back quick. Inside of 10 seconds. That free hand to the body. You got that mouthpiece, right? Incidentally, although it's not that important, since Tyson won, indicated that he was boxing. Another big left hook. A running This fight, he fought hard for about five rounds, and then he seemed to coast a little. He learned in talking to some of the people he fought. Look at the, look at here, look at here. Just look. The reason you tie a fighter up is to at least the this green. That respect from Mike Tyson, mainly because he's not good, beautiful up said, yeah, about a year ago, I was hit by a truck. Very good. Stay busy. Slapping some clothes on a rock. Just nothing happened. Look, you notice the jab, the powerful jab of Tyson. He uh, Mitch Green. He has a durable chin. He's taking some tremendous... Another big left hook. It seems to me that uh, he wants to just walk away. Has a good chin and a huge net. Ha having gone to 10 rounds against Tillis Ray, and not breathing, look at him, he's not breathing at all. Fact or is it still wishful thinking? We'll look at the potential. Didn't mean anything. Tyson's all over him and he's thrown those tremendous left. And he finished with about a third of a tank of gas. What is, what, there, there again, Mitch Green is throwing his, he's moving forward, staying aggressive. Get inside. You got guys that, uh, especially like a Mitch Green, will put to his chopping right hand. Did get in, but again, with <laughs> he's taking his time and just having fun. Eventually, 
another couple body shots. And less fighting. Is actually concentrated. He's looking for his opening. Let me get that water. Stay, Mike. You understand? Don't let him get inside and hit me with uppercut. But his opponent isn't cooperating. But the bag doesn't hit back. Tyson That's hits back. A little bit more leaning going on in this well, round. He, he would throw, Tyson would throw more punches by Mitch Green. His best rally of the fight right here. For Tyson. And now with good body shot by Mitch Green. That was in a different Mitch. It's just, oh, there was his right hand. A huge shot to the ribs by Tyson. Tyson said one time, he said, I under. See the body shots. Yo! Indicates that his management wants to get him tech. Mitch Green has to keep those hands up. One would have the feeling that Mitch Green will not be able to go, let it go, let it go, let it go. Short, so he has a tendency to loop his punches. Um, he's just taking advantage of every opportunity. He performs the fact that he, he's remained composed. Watch it, watch it, watch it. Up. He's holding Davis and Atlanta. It was a more Let's see here. Come on, let it go, let it go. Seems to be something that runs through all of Mike Tyson's yo, yo. opponents that they all. I just don't think that don't Mitchell stand. Green's flurries are doing enough to offset Tyson. Don't take, don't take Curious here, Ray. Wow. You want to see a very aggressive. He has approved he deserves the money. Tyson wants to go to work. It's for Mitch Green. And um, what's going to happen um, is um, I had to cut the ring off and uh, even score more effective punches. It just went off, especially if you have the power. If you meet, meet a good puncher, the speed. Uh, with Mitch Blood Green, the crowd not real thrilled with the. I'm sure Mitch Green is going to be disappointed. Thanks. Yo, yo. Perhaps not being quite as accommodating to Mike Tyson as Tyson. Did a lot of holding on and not effective. Let's take a look then at Harold Letterman's card. And Tyson perhaps would have liked. Let's go up to the ring announcer now, Ed Darien. For the Pat Dolan watched it at 9-1. Many folks. Mike Tyson.